Good morning everyone and this is already the ninth vlog. Eh? Ninth vlog must have a new look, new haircut. So the previous vlog I was introducing the small fishes uh, and their names. For this vlog I'll be introducing the, like a medium-sized fishes. Eh? So you get to know more fishes. Alright, so let's take a look at them. Okay, let's go on to this first fish. In English, it's called tilapia. In uh, Malay, we call it ikan tilapia or ikan dipun. So this is very commonly uh, eaten by the Filipinos and it, it's actually considered as the Filipino, their national fish. Uh, they usually cook in a way whereby they barbecue it, put a layer of salt and they have this barbecue or they just have uh, stir fried it in their gravy. Moving on to the second fish. This is called in English, it's called the golden banded drop fish. And in Malay, we call it ikan krisi. This fish, very common one. Sometimes in the coffee shop, you see that what? Uh, their advertisement, they got the fish head curry uh, offer. Uh, they usually use this fish head. And this, for this fish in my hand, it's, it's a very medium sized one. Uh, zi cha, they usually use a more bigger one. So the name of this is the golden banded drop fish, and in Malay, it's called ikan krisi. So moving on to the last fish of the day, it's this is called the leather jacket. Sorry that this fish don't have the head. Uh. It, it usually have the head and uh, actually it's a very special fish. They have uh, actually a skin. A uh, very very uh, rough skin, it's not skill, skin. Uh. And in Malay it's called the ikan barat barat. This fish uh, is very nice if you take it to fry uh, and accompany with light sauce, light soya sauce. Uh. It's very nice. Uh. So remember this fish, leather jacket. Or it can be called in Malay. Ikan Barat Barat Alright So now let's do a recap So I've come to the end of my vlog And I hope you learned a thing or two on the medium fishes today So the most important thing you must know is the name first You don't know the name, how you gonna buy? All right, and some of the characteristics and how people actually go about cooking these kind of fishes. And for the upcoming vlog, I'll be trying to showcase to you guys uh, on the commonly found fishes in Singapore market. So I'll see you on my next vlog. Remember to subscribe, like, share, and i see you on my next vlog. Goodbye.